Hello YouTube. I'm very sorry how I look. Uh, I am very tired and um, this is my 33 weeks pregnancy update. And um, yes, I have some days are really energetic and some days are not that good. And today I went to work and I did not want to work. I don't know how the time passed and I went to work out uh, during my lunch time and uh, I hardly could do uh, 20 minutes on the elliptical. It was very hard. Walking, talking, everything is pretty hard for me today. I thought maybe my diet is not that good because I'm eating lots of junk. <laughs> so I went to market and I spent my last energy there and I, uh, I bought tilapia and I bought some uh, stuff to make salad with it. So tonight it's my mini. I'm trying to smile really for you guys, I'm sorry. So this week's um, the worst uh, symptom was leg cramps. I am having it's three uh, nights in a row I had uh, really horrible leg cramps and I am worrying that I will have it tonight too. And um, it wakes me up and it's pretty painful. And I drink tons of water during the day, but I don't know, it's not working. I'm not allowed to eat bananas, but I bought bananas because the pain is too much. And um, that's one. And the second is my baby hiccups. <laughs> uh, as you guys know, it's it's pretty long time that I've been feeling the baby hiccups, but um, they're very, very cute. But sometimes it gets like, ah, oh, enough. <laughs> it's too much. <laughs> it's just, I'm not trying to complain. It's just uh, how sometimes I feel it's a lot sometimes. And um, uh, I'm having a trouble with uh, sleeping. First of all, my husband is sick. Uh, it has been three days. Uh, he's very sick. And once I get interrupted during my sleep, I can I'm having a really hard time falling back to sleep. And um all night I'm turning side to side with my <laughs> body pillow. <laughs> it has to turn one side to the other side with me, so it's pretty hard. And uh my husband wakes up middle of the night or he comes to bed late and then my leg cramp comes in and I have so busy mind that I'm thinking all the time, uh what we need to do, is there anything missing for the baby, am I going to be a good mother, how the labor is going to be, so this is all those kind of things are spinning in my mind and I'm having a really hard time uh, falling asleep. Um, I This is another new symptom but I thought that I never talked about it, it is the my uh, nose is bleeding uh, constantly, it's like in the morning I cannot breathe. I have to blow my nose and it has been happening so long and my nose is bleeding uh, in the morning especially. It's not fun. <laughs> and um, that, this is a sad uh, part actually so um, I uh, moved to United States um, three and a half years ago. And I am so happy that I got my citizenship uh, last week and it was wonderful and I was in tears and it was a very emotional day for me. I used my all energy to make myself a little bit pretty. I will try to put some pictures at the end of this video so you guys can see me better than this. <laughs> and um, it was a wonderful day. And um, unfortunately, in this three and a half years that I had, I tried so much to have friends and all my friends, uh, friendship, they were so shallow or uh, they weren't right people. I mean, uh, I tried everything but it just didn't work. 
I really wanted girlfriends <laughs> and I can talk and you know do girl stuff together and um, I had a few friends that uh, we uh, see each other two, two girls uh, we see each other we try every, every month so uh, you know we, we're trying to see each other and catch up with each other so those girls wanted to give uh, throw a, a baby shower for me I'm like, uh, okay, but I'm not sure how that's gonna work because there's nobody else. And then, uh, we, I tried to, uh, forward, the, they published on Facebook and they told me that I can forward to anyone I like and they're gonna take care of everything. And I'm like, okay. I tried and I forward the invitation to a few people. Unfortunately, they said no. They, they found thousands of excuses and I understand and even I wrote there that I don't need their presence or anything that I gave my uh, you know registration to them but I said it's I don't care about the presence it's just gonna be fun <laughs> I was really looking forward to it because it's not my tradition and it's like um, when you it's not your tradition you want to learn about it it's like how it works and I never been in a baby shower never seen one <laughs> just maybe videos that I've watched uh, on YouTube that was it so I cried for that uh, it just didn't work out and I told my girlfriends they're still hopeful they're still waiting someone may show up and um, my ha we thought that maybe we can do it unisex and my husband's friends can come but unfortunately the same day uh, they had some football game and my husband said they wouldn't come and baby shower was a woman thing so they wouldn't come at all <laughs> I'm like okay and there were two girls in his work and they said uh, what they said are oh, they gonna work that day even it's Saturday it was weird um, the company that I'm working for, uh, the people there, they uh, did not want to do at home party. It's like a few people there, like I think it's like five, six people, and um, they didn't want to come home, come to my house, uh, so they rejected too. So I think uh, my girlfriends, two girlfriends, and I will just go out and eat lunch that day, and. If they want to give me present, they will, and that was a total disaster. And I totally lost my hope about making friends or anything here. It's just not gonna happen because I did not go to like school with anybody here, and uh, now I'm at work, and um, it's obvious that I'm working all day. I don't have any time to maintain a friendship at work with anybody and I don't see anyone that's willing to do that so and um, so uh, at work they said uh, they want to do a baby shower but uh, there's another guy in another uh, department he used to be in our group but uh, his wife is pregnant and I think she's one month uh, behind me and um, they wanted to do together our baby shower so that just you know blew for me I just did not like it and it's not so important to me either <laughs> and um, I did I knew it was going to be like this and um, and my husband's family is not like people who like to give <laughs> and they're receivers, they're not viewers <laughs> and um, they maybe a few of them are nice but uh, in general they are not. not I mean not not nice uh, I mean they wouldn't buy anything for the baby and uh, only I think my brother bought something really cool it was the uh, car seat and uh, a carriage for the baby and um, that's about it I don't count uh, anyone buying clothes for baby which nobody did except my mother-in-law she bought like three uh, outfit that's all and 
we've been buying everything. We did not get any help, which is actually okay because we're both working and we actually really don't need anybody's help. It's just, I mean, it will be really nice because I put there uh, two, three dollars uh, stuff, you know, just the, you know, I, to be polite that you can just come and give you, give to me and uh, say, uh, I just thought about you and you know got you something for your baby so you will remember me when you're using it so that's not gonna happen and I'm not gonna cry <laughs> right now so I'm heartbroken to people about this and I know that uh, when you're pregnant you're emotional so uh, my baby shower was a disaster so I'm not having any the baby showers that people are trying to do does not mean anything to me <laughs> and only to my two of my girlfriends they are seem to be good people and we'll go out uh, eat lunch of course uh, I will make sure that everybody pays their own I won't let anyone to pay mine or anything and um, other than that I am planning on getting manicure pedicure on around like 35 36 weeks and I'm t <laughs> thinking about uh, uh, getting my massage more often uh, when I'm clo uh, getting close to my uh, delivery time and now I'm not counting the weeks anymore I'm counting the days and I will say 49 days left yes that's just so amazing <laughs> And I'm so excited to have my baby and I wanted her so much and I hope she will like me too. <laughs> and um, I think that's pretty much it and thank you for watching and if you have any questions please ask me. You can subscribe my channel too. Also I'm preparing a Facebook page and I will uh, try to put the link down but uh, don't think it's anything good right now I'm so new about those kind of stuff so I'm just trying to prepare it and uh, I'm so open to any ideas too or if, if you guys have any experience you want to let me know it will be better that way just let me know okay and uh, I'll give you guys a billy shot oh, uh, by the way the weight gain is every week one pound and I'm on track. <laughs> I'm not gaining so much this time. And I already gained over 30 pounds. So let me show. I'm sorry for my breathing. Okay. Okay, this is my belly. It's from the front. And it's from the side. 33 weeks. Pregnant belly. Okay, 